What's up YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug. I'm back again with my Oster 5 Core Air Fryer. Alright guys, we're low carbon today. It's football Sunday and I want to make some low carb keto friendly zucchini fries. See I got my almond flour, my parmesan shredded cheese, my go-to seasoning one egg for egg wash. Yep, let's get started. First things first, I'm going to take some of my almond flour and just pour it right in this dish. And I'm just going to season it. Yeah, I think that's enough. That should be enough. I didn't show you before, but I just thought of it. I'm going to add some Italian seasoning to this. Why not? And guys, I've never made this before, so bear with me. This is my go-to. So this is pink salt, black pepper, and garlic powder. We want our fries to be full of flavor, y'all. And finally, some shredded cheese. I mean, shredded Parmesan cheese, I'm sorry. Well, that should be enough. And if you can get finely shredded, that would be even better. Of course, shredding it yourself would be best, actually, but, you know. So I'm just gonna mix this up, guys. I'm gonna give it a taste, make sure it's legit. And then we'll cut up our zucchinis, bread them, and fry them. We should be good to go. I'm going to add some more Parmesan cheese and some more uh, just salt. Pink salt. I think that should get me where I need to be. All right, guys, that's perfect. All right, so we're just going to get an egg in here real quick. Guys, I'm going to do two eggs just to be sure, you know. All right, we're good to go there. Not sure if I need three zucchinis, but hey, I'd rather have it than not. So anyway, let's begin. The way I rinsed off my zucchini. So we're gonna um, go ahead and chop off the ends. Like that. Then I wanna chop it in half. And then chop it in half again. And then from here, we're going to make our slices. Some of you can cut way better than me. But you want to, don't make it too thick. So these hold, you know, these hold water and stuff. And the thicker you cut it, the more chances of it being soggy um, it can be. But just try and make it as uniform as you can. That's too thin. Not the greatest of cuts, guys, but if I could do it, you definitely could do it. So I would say one zucchini per person, I guess. Because this is, this is more than enough for me to snack on while I'm watching the game. And this is one zucchini. Make sure you subscribe to my channel so YouTube can alert you when my next video drops as well as my uh, YouTube live giveaways. Oh, and by the way, guys, I know some of my keto folks are going to say or suggest that I could use pork rinds for this, and that is true. You can crush them up and put them in there, and they'll be fantastic. But I'm these days, with my low carb, I'm also looking at the sodium intake that I'm doing as well. So because of that, I left it out. But that is a good good substitute and adds a great amount of flavor as well. But anywho, let's get our egg wash in here. Get it in there good. You could probably use a spoon and do this. Just make sure everything gets it and then just cover it. You don't want to overdo it. You don't have to overdo it. Just make sure all of it gets it. Then you just put it to the side. And keep doing until you're done. All right, guys. So now that I have it breaded, you want to get both sides with uh, your oil spray. I, I happen to have an Evo oil sprayer with avocado oil in there. Olive oil would be fine. And remember, just get both sides. All right, guys. I got my Oster fryer basket out. So we're going to put the uh, fries in. All right, guys. So we're going to get it in the air fryer now. I'm going to do... 
gets 400 degrees for like 20 minutes. I'll check it at probably eight minutes and just see how it goes from there. All right, so we're gonna do, leave it at 400 like we said, and I'll bump it up time to 20 minutes. And we'll check it eight minutes to halfway. But there you have it guys. Now, I let it go for 15 minutes. I checked it at eight, it was okay. Checked it at 10, I was like, it could go a little more. And 15 minutes, I think we're good. So I'm just gonna let this cool. And then we're gonna have a bite. Shout out to my viewers and subscribers that hit the like button way before my video is even finished. I appreciate that. See that? 2.6 carbs. You first. Got it? All right, you saw the paper towel go up. That means it's time to eat. All right, guys, I am ready to take a bite first. Let's grab, let's grab a wing. You first. You got it? Mm. Nothing but flavor. Mm -mm -mm. This is sugar free barbecue sauce, sweet and spicy by G Hughes. Very good. Mm -mm -mm. Alright, guys, I got some blue cheese. I got a flat right here, so let's let's try it. You first. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. It's too good. Mm. Guys, enough of that. I'm sorry. Let's try it. Let's try zucchini fries, guys. You first. You got it? Oh, yeah. This is so good, guys. That Italian seasoning takes it to the next level. For sure. You got to put Italian seasoning in there. Or, or at the very least, complete seasoning. Very good. All right, guys. Let's dip it. Some in. Dip one in some blue cheese. Ranch would be good too. You got it? Mm. The blue cheese is better. Very good, guys. And by the way, blue cheese doesn't have carbs. The blue cheese that I used had zero carbs. Very good, guys. Great substitute for fries. I'm not saying you're not going to miss them, but it'll definitely take your mind off of it, I'll tell you that. This is good. Mm. Before I go, I don't know where I picked up this um, barbecue sugar-free seasoning from. It's okay. It has a hint of barbecue flavor to it. So, eh, it's okay. You'll definitely need some help, you know, and I helped it out with my, my go-to pink salt, black pepper, and garlic. But um, what really made a difference is this. This is, this is really good. Any one of his sauces is good. Anywho, guys, just sharing yet another low-carb recipe with you guys. I'm going to sit down and enjoy this and watch the games. My Giants don't play till Monday, tomorrow. So I get to watch all the games and hope everyone in my division lose. That would be the Cowboys, the Redskins, and the Eagles. <laughs> so anyway, I'm watching. What am I watching now? The Steelers and Ravens. That's a good game. But anywho, if you have this Osta air fryer or any air fryer, we'd love to see what you're making in your air fryer in my um, air fryer group. It's called Air, fryer, air Frying with Doug. We have over 63,000 members in there. And come in and show off. Show us how you get down. Or do a search and then get recipes. I'll, I'll leave a link in the description. 
And guys, if you have an Instagram, look me up at Instagram Cooking with Doug. But that's all I got. So hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. If anything, thanks for just even looking at my video, y'all. It's Cooking with Doug.